Hi, my name is Jasmine Wilcher from Indiana Math and Science Academy North, and this demonstration is called Indicator Sponge. So what you're going to need for this demonstration is um, hydrochloric acid, sodium iodide, red and blue food coloring, and tap water. So I already put 30 milliliters of hydrochloric acid in this cylinder with red food coloring, and I put 30 milliliters of um, sodium hydroxide in this cylinder with blue food color. So what basically is going to happen in this demonstration is I'm going to put this um, indicator sponge into the red solution and I'm going to see what happens and then I'm going to put it inside the blue solution to see what happens. So I'm just going to put it in this red solution. Come on. Okay, you can start talking now. Leave it. And as you can see, it turned blue. But why did it turn blue if I put it inside a red um, solution? And the sponge was red too. Let me let me see if I wash it off. If it will, if the blue would come off with it. <coughs> It's still blue. It still didn't come Hold on. Off. Repeat that again. Take it out. Don't lift it too much. What? But it still came off. Yeah. What? Dip it in here? Okay. <coughs> but nothing came off. It's still blue. So I'm going to dip it inside the blue solution to see what happens. And it, it turned back red. So basically what happened in this demonstration is that I put this indicator sponge inside the red solution. And this is also called Congo Red. So when I put it inside the red solution, it's really acid. So if you put this indicator inside the acid, it's going to turn blue because it's acid on it. And when you put it inside the blue solution, um, this is a base solution. So if you put it inside this, it's telling you that there's no more acid on the sponge. So it's going to turn <coughs> to its original color. 